Long ago, when someone said high power lasers, they were probably referring to a few kilowatts. Nowadays, there are commercially available systems producing continuous beam powers of many tens of kilowatts. And research applications exist, both commercial and otherwise, for beams with CW powers of 100 kilowatts. In a material processing application, for example, a manufacturer using lasers to cut sheet metal, a very high power beam can be divided among multiple processing stations, enabling the manufacturer to produce more parts in parallel using a single laser. More exotic applications for very high power beams include military, fusion research, and others. There are some serious technical challenges involved in measuring such beams. Cooling. All those many tens of kilowatts coming into the sensor must be removed at least as quickly as they come in. The sensor's absorber must be able to handle not only the total power, but also the power density, all those kilowatts per square centimeter. At high power beams, this is much more difficult than it is with lower power beams. Higher powers normally require a more massive sensor. However, the more massive the sensor, the slower its response time becomes. If the beam is being sampled, a beam dump must be provided in order to prevent the rest of the beam from endangering anyone or anything nearby. A few percent of back reflection from the sensor's absorber surface may be trivial for lower power beams, but a few percent of 100 kilowatts is still a lot of power being reflected back from the sensor. Ophir offers a range of solutions for measuring such beams. At 500 watts, which used to be considered high power once, we can still use fan cooling. For 1 kilowatt, 5 kilowatts, 10 kilowatts, and now 30 kilowatts, we offer water-cooled sensors. These have large apertures with broadband absorbers. Their front flanges have mounting holes to enable attachment of various accessories such as fiber adapters. When high power meters are used in an industrial metalworking environment, the sensors can get completely fouled with debris and read completely wrong. Ophir now offers a protective enclosure to prevent this problem. The enclosure has a solenoid operated shutter to cover the absorber when the sensor is not in operation. A range of fan and water cooled beam dumps are also available. The first commercial sensor for measuring up to 100 kilowatts was recently announced. Ophir's 100 kW sensor is designed for fiber lasers used in industrial material processing such as thermal ablation, heavy section welding and metal forming, as well as military directed energy applications. This sensor is small, measuring 50 centimeters in each dimension and captures over 99% of the radiation, minimizing safety hazards. The response time of the 100 kW is less than one minute, a fraction of the time required by custom non-commercial systems. It is compatible with all standard Ophir meters and PC interfaces. Contact Ophir if we can help you with your application through your local Ophir representative or via our website.